really think that they can have a weaponized smallpox that's genetically keyed that will be more effective in, in penetrating your uh, stuff here, your, your cells, and killing you uh, than natural smallpox, and they've been trying to engineer it. So there's all these bio labs around the planet. And so they're being taken out as part of this global overthrow of the Kazarian Mafia, what we call the globalists. Okay, this group that has infiltrated the Jews, the Jewish population, and has always used them as a cover, as a sacrificial cover. They are the Judas goat in the sense that they are the, the, the Kazarian Mafia, right? They surround themselves with sheep such that the sheep get killed and they get to escape. Um, and so... So this is not about the Jews. The Jews are put there. They, it, the Kazarian Mafia has designed a mindset to make people hate Jews. I kid you not. They, this, the, all of the crimes of the Kazarian Mafia, from the days of the, of the blood sucking, from we, which we get the vampires, okay? Because they were trying to do this adrenochrome shit because of what the Elohim had told them. You've got to read it through the, the Zohar, read that through into the Talmud, read that through into the Torah. And you will see that they're talking about adrenochrome in the, in the days, I know it dates through in the 1800s, uh, so... Um, uh, pre-revolution back in uh, uh, Kansk, in this area in Russia here, in central Russia, and they were going to claim, the, the Khazarians were going to claim, try and have Russia give them this area here and, and let the Jews uh, take it over later uh, as, a, as part, anyway, but uh, it was a central point, there was a big Jewish population, but it was an infiltrated Jewish population that had the Khazarians, the name stealers inculcated, and these people then, in the 1800s, went around and took blood. And it set up this whole thing about vampirism and all of this kind of stuff, associating it in early 1800, may have even been earlier, it might have been in the 1700s, that it actually really began and then it became inculcated in the 1800s to the point that there was this legend about blood-sucking Jews. Now, ultimately, they converted that idea over to the idea that these people were avaricious and blood was translated over to currency. So there's all of this language fuckery that goes on with these people, with the name stealers. Okay, but let me tell you that the Jewish population is not, it, as I say, they're there as a sacrifice. They're there for you to hate so that you don't ever get at the Khazarian Mafia that's in, infiltrated them, that has uh, taken them over the way they've taken over the Biden White House and all of that kind of shit, right? So, uh, so <laughs> this is why if you send me emails and stuff and you're hating on Jews, you can just go fuck yourself. You can just go fuck yourself. You're